Hey, what's up, IT Pro? Steve the Network Advisor here. Hey, I've been testing out a new tool called the NextLab NetMeter N1. I've had it on loan from NextLab for the oh, past few weeks, and I'm ready to show it to you. For one thing, it's this cool little cube, right? And it's very durable. And what I'm going to do is show you what it does that solves a lot of problems for me. So as a field engineer, I oftentimes get asked to do trivial little tasks that require me to go and get my laptop out. And sometimes that's a real pain because I have to go out to the truck, I get the laptop, I gotta wait for it to boot up. If the battery happens to be dead, I gotta find power. Well, that's what this takes the place of, and it's wonderful. So I'm gonna power it up. So imagine I've got the workflow scenario where I've got a user that I'm trying to diagnose a connectivity issue. Maybe it's either no connection, or no connection to the internet, or maybe slow connection. Well, this little cube right here, the, the NextLab NetMeter N1, basically takes the place of a lot of the tasks I would use my laptop for. So on the back, it's got two ports, WAN and local area network. Well, what I'm gonna do is take the user's ethernet cord and plug it into WAN, and then I can see the lights in the front. I know you can't see those, but I'll show you in a minute. And what I'm waiting for is for the, for the ready light to turn green, which tells me that I've pulled a DHCP address and I have connection out to the internet. But I did get a solid green, so now let me, here's where it gets cool. So then I take my phone, this is how I manage it. So this is my pane of glass for managing this, which is really cool. So then what I do is go to... You go into the management page and there's icons for each one of the different tests they have. Now this may change by the time this is finally released, but the ones I use the most are speed test and probably connection info. Uh, but I have ex been experimenting a lot more with iPerf lately, running it either as a server or as a client, which has been pretty cool. But anyway, I just want to right now just get connection info. So I'm going to go in here into connection info. All right, I can see that I pulled the you know, 192, 168 address. Okay, great. It's on local area network. That tells me what VLAN I'm on, right? I can see that I got DNS. I can see my mask and I can see my external IP. All right, so now I know what gateway on the street side that I'm going out to the rest of the world on. All right, that's great. But maybe... Maybe connection issue wasn't a problem, but it was more like a not so good connection. Well, I'm gonna go run speed test. So come in here, speed test, and start the speed test. And the way I'll know that this is communicating, well, I mean, I click start on here, but then what happens is the light turns blue on my net meter. I know you can't see that from here, but I'll, I'll show you that. So my light turns blue. That means that it, the test is in progress, right? All right, and then meanwhile, I've got my painted glass here where I can see the, the test in progress, see the ping times, I can see the, you know, the download speeds, etc. If you've been following lately, you've noticed I've been doing a lot of new construction. And the NextLab net meter has been real convenient for dealing with these less than friendly environments where I don't really want to drag a laptop into a dusty place. Plus, where do you set a laptop in a place like this? And that reminds me of another workflow, which is these service delivery technicians working for these major ISPs. Yet oftentimes they're in places when the comm rooms are still new. There may or may not be power. It's dusty. There's no flat surface to set your laptop on. But you have to collect a series of metrics on the circuit you just delivered before you can check it off as being complete. Well, the little NextLab NetMeter N1 cube really doesn't care. It can hang from a string for that matter. And all you need to do is just whip out your phone, collect your metrics, and off you go. The NextLab NetMeter N1 should be available sometime this summer of 2024. I'll keep you posted with subsequent videos, or you can look in the description of this one. I appreciate your time today, and we'll see you on the next one.